if you're going to volunteer for 15 weeks every summer, that's a, that's a big ask. So it needs to be enjoyable. It needs to be engaging. They need to be um, having fun themselves as well. So that's a very much big um, element of the of our program. We struck on one thing: it's recognition. They're not after, you know, money. They're not after anything other than a bit of recognition for the hard work and dedication they're doing. So we call that out on our social media platforms uh, consistently. We have volunteers of the round. Um, yes, we, we, we might throw them a, a little bit of a prize or whatever from our sponsors, but that's, that's secondary. Um, the fact that they're being called out and, uh, and we're just saying, hey, well done, couldn't have done it without you. Um, I really think gets them to, to get a bit of pep in their step and they keep coming back for the next weekend. Basically thanking them for their efforts. Um, so many times I think there's a lot of volunteers at clubs that it's a thankless task and no one actually recognises that and, and they don't get excited about what they've achieved. So we try and again, try and give them that, that real excitement. Thank you very much for being part of the club. From our perspective, it's really been able to give people a purpose and an idea of what are they doing and what's their outcome at the club. The best thing that we can offer is recognition and that's really, really important. So every opportunity that we can, whether it's um, we're speaking in front of the club or we're speaking in front of the parents um, or at award ceremonies um, or in our newsletter every week, every time recognising uh, the absolute huge contribution that's made on a weekly basis every summer and the impact and showing them the impact. So we make sure that we are acknowledging them both uh, privately but also publicly. Um, with their blessings, of course, that, uh, that we, we make a bit of a song and dance about it, that we don't have any, anyone paid in our club at all. So we are, you know, the, I think the third oldest in, uh, in Victoria, and we are the largest in the RDCA, or the Ringwood District Cricket Association. So that, I think, you know, really, really says a lot where we don't need to go out and get someone paid to do stuff. We've always got people knocking on the door, what can I do to help? Um, what needs to be done, and even outside of their remit, 